Hi, I'm Alex. I'm the head brewer at Full Circle, uh, and this is Josh. I'm Josh, the Patterson Supervisor here. Um, so we were in contact with Vava um, before the invasion uh, by Russia, and we'd already organised for Martin to come over and do a collaboration with us. Um, however, due to the change of circumstances, um, we decided to uh, change the the kind of intention of the collaboration um, and after speaking again with, with Martin and a couple of other breweries in the UK uh, we decided to brew the Ukrainian Golden Ale, um, a style that uh, was relatively new um, but far far were championing in, in Ukraine. Uh, it's a style that we've not brewed before um, but we did our own spin on it, we did a, a dry hop on it um, and we left the beer unfiltered and unfined so it was relatively hazy. Um, had a, quite a high finishing gravity, uh, so for the UK market it was a relatively sweet beer, um, but it was definitely very well received. Um, the the Atenum in it um, gave a lovely kind of piney, noble um, balance to the beer uh, to kind of balance the sweetness as well. Uh, this is something that meant quite a bit of myself as well because I've got family over in Ukraine, um, some of whom are fighting as well. Uh, so the money that we raised with this collab went entirely to Medical Aid Northeast, uh, which is a charity which works in the same industrial state as us. Um, they were providing medical kits like first aid kits, which are focused on like trauma first aid kits um, to help people who have been wounded in combat over there. So we were very lucky to also receive uh, a lot of free materials for the beer. Um, so we were free, received free grain, uh, we received uh, hops that included don donations to Ukraine. Um, we received free key kegs, uh, so all that helped us uh, raise more money uh, for the for the medical packs. And the beer itself was was very well received. We did it in a mixture of uh, key kegs, can, and a, bit, a few steel kegs as well. Um, all sold out very quickly. And even, even today, we sometimes get asked, "Do you have any of that beer still available?" Um, like I say, it was a, a new style for us um, and a new style for our local market, especially. Um, but uh, everyone seems to love it. Um, it's worthwhile adding as well that it's important to recognise new styles that are coming from places that you wouldn't usually expect beer to come from. Um, Ukraine's not really been a big leader in beer production freebie, um, especially on like, the European scale of things as well. Um, so it's good to showcase something like that. Um, it's important to recognise that we're nearly a year into this as well. Um, I'm sure I speak for everyone when we say we would hope this would have been over sooner than it is, but um, it's obviously still as much of a problem as it is. Uh, as it was at the very start, as much as you don't hear about it anymore. Um, it's still really important to donate as much as you can, or as little as you can, or to share information about these projects going on, like Medical Aid Northeast. Um, there's still a lot of these charities going on, which are providing crucial support to people who are caught up in the conflict.